Hey guys, welcome back to Back in XI, and today we're going to be talking about sulfur. Alright, so as many of you might know, sulfur is a very dangerous compound. And uh, I'm wearing a gas mask today, because this shit is smelly. Hey everybody, welcome back to Back Max Eye, and today I'm gonna put my lungs on the line for 732 strangers. Like I said, today we're gonna be looking at sulfur and one of its many unique allotropes. Sulfur is number 16 on the periodic table, right below oxygen, so you already know this is gonna be a good video. Hashtag drop a like! As you see in front of you, you got the basic yellow powder that smells like volcano and looks like Big Bird's dandruff. This is elemental sulfur in its crystalline octatomic molecular structure which means it is stable as an eight unit ring-like configuration. It looks like this. Obviously, you didn't come to see a boring old element showcase video, and I don't intend on giving you one. This isn't dangerous enough or smelly enough for me, so to go one step further, let's melt it down and break some bonds. Oddly enough, molten sulfur is still in the cyclic structure we started with, and no bonds are actually broken. But when the temperature of the molten sulfur increases, that's when it gets freaky. This venom-like liquid has a higher viscosity than molten beta sulfur because the bonds break and the S8 polymerizes, forming long chains of gamma sulfur. To make sure the conversion was complete, I continued to heat it. In order to get our desired amorphous sulfur, we get some cold water that will cool the molten sulfur down so quickly that the polymerized chains will stick together in an irregular pattern. The resulting substance is plastic sulfur. It's stretchier than taffy and more putrid than Satan's ass. Sadly, the fun doesn't last long though because on cooling, the unstable amorphous sulfur begins reverting back to its more sane alter ego, alpha sulfur. What that means is it stiffens in under a minute, all its elasticity is gone, and I rage quit faster than the flash in Flashpoint. It took two hours to make this, two seconds to harden, and only half a second to form sulfuric acid in my throat. 